hello everyone and welcome to the channel in this video guys i'm going to guide how to download the iso file of windows 10 and make a bootable pen drive in 2020-25 so this is the latest video as of now so you just need to open any browser which you generally use and you need to search the windows 10 iso download on the search bar and once you search that you should be able to see the microsoft website just click on the microsoft website only and once you go into the microsoft website we need to look for windows 10 iso file okay so we need to first of all we need to download the media creation tool in order to download the iso file now you can keep it anywhere on it just click on that and once the iso file is downloaded guys you need to insert your pen drive the bootable pen drive which you are going to make in this video i'm going to show you this is my bootable pen drive it's not bootable right now but uh, i will make it bootable so make sure you delete all the data or backup all the data before you process this otherwise all the data will be lost from your usb pen drive okay so you just need to click on download button here and once you download that simply go to the downloaded exe media creation tool and double click on the setup and click on yes button when the prompt opens and we have two options to make a bootable pen drive one is directly without downloading the iso file and another one is downloading the iso file i will show you both options now you need to accept this terms and condition simply accept that now you will see two options here so basically we are going to create a bootable pen drive select the second option here then click on next option now leave everything as default 64 bit windows 10 united state if you want to change it you can simply change it from here but that is not recommended just keep it as it is and click on next now you can download the iso file as well but this will download the iso file within your computer but if you want to directly make a bootable pen drive of usb you just need to click on this option then click on next and now you can see you will see two options here select your bootable pen drive this is my g drive as i have already shown you this one okay i need to select the d drive here you can see here this is my d drive not the g1 is different and you need to click on next option here so once you click on next option bootable pen drive will be made automatically without using the rufo software but if you want to download the iso file on your computer and want to do it keep it later so you can select a rufo's download go to first link and simply you need to download here the first option standard one click on exe download close the advertisement and also give the location again okay once the rufos is also downloaded okay it's downloaded now you just need to double click on this but in order to run the rufos you must have the iso file should be downloaded on your computer so i have selected just this option downloading windows 10 and this will directly make my bootable pen drive so this is the first way you don't need to do anything just wait for 100 percent and now the second way i will show you with the rufus one okay 
just double click on this Rufus click on yes now since I have already downloaded the ISO file in my laptop so you can select here the options click on here select and now select the ISO file where you have downloaded on your computer so I have selected my Windows 10 ISO file here just click on that and click on open and it will scan but this option is only for those who want to work on the ISO file later as well but if you are going for one time just select the option which I have already shown you without using any third party software like Rufus or other third party software now you can see options here I recommend you to choose the NTFS file system here this is the latest and partition scheme should be GPT and UEFI should be selected here ok and just click on here start option just leave everything untick then click on ok click on ok all the data will be lost from your USB app now you need to wait here and this will also create your bootable pen drive simply you can see here the storage with the USB you have selected just wait here it will go to 100% and then I will show you now guys this has been done let me show you just click on close and it's always good to make sure that the bootable pen drive is done you can see here now our windows 10 bootable file is ready you can install the windows 10 on any machine which is compatible for windows 10 so that's all for this video guys so i hope this video helps you if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching